Oh, okay. And then once they put it in, then they put the amounts in there. And then it goes, well done, sir. Yeah. station in Nigeria and I'm trying to understand how it works here so I want to take you guys on a journey so typically in the US there's not people manning the gas the fuel you go on there you go inside you pay and you tell them what number it is that you want to fill and they fill it or you go to the gas place and use your card but here, they usually have like an attendant that mans the pump and then they pump it for you. But I think these guys are feeling some sort of keg for something. But usually, there's somebody that mans the station. Now, I'm going to ask my driver some questions. <laughs> Sir, so how do they, who do you pay? You pay them? You can pay them cash or and they regulate how much comes in. Yes, yes. So they have unlimited supply on their hands. From the very pump, you yeah. set how much you want to buy, or they can just sell and have it done. They look at the leader. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So you can tell them how much, and they set it, and then it ends. Yes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So they don't have unlimited access to pump. They still have to set it. Oh, okay. So their job is to just take the money and pump for you. Or do you you do people ever pump for themselves? No, ever. Oh wow. Okay. Do you tip them usually? No. Or that's just their job. Must be the company that employs the attendants. Yes. It's a salary thing. Oh. Okay. So, but they still have to set it. Yes. Okay. So, how? So we usually buy per gallon in the US. What, what do you buy? Per liter. per liter. Wait, how many liters in a gallon? Four liters is one gallon. Yes. Yeah. Four liters. Four liters of liquid something. Okay. So how much is a gallon? I mean, how much is a liter of petrol? <laughs> oh, you use this. So we need one. to find out how much. Yeah, we need to go to the pump. Yeah. The petrol. Oh, 163. So it's 163 naira per liter. I need to convert to how much that is per gallon. Because in US, ga gas is like $3, $4 per gallon. Sometimes it's $2. Per so if it's 163 naira per liter. We might just round down to let's just say let's just say 150, and we're at the 13 liter. So 150 times four is 600 naira. If we add those little like 13, 13, that would be roughly like another 60 bucks. So 660 naira per gallon if I'm comparing, and 660 naira. Wow, it's way cheaper. So 660 naira is roughly one dollar and twenty-five cents per gallon in Nigeria. Wow. I, I think it must be subsidized. Yes, it is subsidized. Okay. They are trying to remove the subsidy. The government is trying to remove yeah. the subsidy. And when they do, it's going to be like a oh, they can't two, do that. Two hundred and eighty something and three hundred and eighty dollars per liter. Wow. So according to the inflation here and the way cost uh, they pay people here, I think the government needs to continue to subsidize petrol. Um, wow, I hope they don't remove that quite yet. So I think because the government is government subsidized, it ends up being like a dollar twenty-five cents per gallon, which is way cheaper than it would be. In US sometimes it goes up to two to five dollars uh, per gallon. So it looks like he takes the money through POS, they pay, and then they set the gas over there. 
That's what's happening. Yes, sir. I have an example. Can wow. That's the receipt they show of how much it is. Oh, okay. And then once they put it in, then they put the amount in there. And then it goes, well done, sir. Yeah. We're trying to learn the ninja system of gas pumping. <laughs> so you pay, um, he pays you and then you put the money in there, Abby. And it ends, right? I think. It would naturally stop. So this is the price per liter. Wow! It already went up. Is this the price? Huh? Oh, I thought it was 165 per liter. Oh, this is for diesel. Okay, okay, okay. So this is diesel prices. How much is it for petrol? Sir? 165. Okay. This is center. That's it, that's our gas there. Pumps, all good. Thank you. All right, that is how it works, people. So if you ever come to Nigeria, it's a different system. <laughs> but I think in some states in the US, they still have somebody that mans the petrol. Very interesting. But, you know, we always talk about business efficiency. But at the same time, people are being employed, so I don't mind sharing. But typically, technology is negative and positive. Because <laughs> technology can in, in actually replace that guy's job. If they have an automated system that you go, you put your own POS, and you buy your gas and you leave. It might eventually get there. But yeah. But anyways, that's the system of how to get gas in Nigeria. Alright guys, remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And watch my Life in Lagos series if you want to learn about all things Lagos related and the way of living here. And lastly, remember to rise and let your light shine. Peace.